Let's now get you this next piece of breaking news that we have on the broadcast and this concerns the elections in 2024 and as far as the Delhi Congress is concerned there is a big statement that has come out. Congress leader Alka Lamba has in fact said that the Delhi Congress will be contesting on all the seven seats. Big news there as far as uh, the 224 elections are concerned. No seat sharing between the Amadmi Party and the Congress party, that is what we are learning. What exactly has Al Kalamba really said? Let's for that, listen into that reaction first and then we will get a coulis on this. तीन घंटे की मीटिंग में पूर्व कांग्रेस अध्यक्ष राहुल गांधी जी खरगे जी के सी विनुगोपाल जी और दीपक बावरिया जी रहे तीन घंटे की मीटिंग शुरुआत हुई संगठन को लेकर कि संगठन कमजोरियां क्या है उस पर कैसे काम किया जाए सुझाव आए उसको कैसे हम मजबूत कर सकते हैं दूसरा सुझाव ये आया कि लोकसभा 2024 की तैयारियां अब हमें करनी है मकसद वही था दिल्ली से पहले 18 राज्यों की मीटिंगें हो चुकी हैं लोकसभा की तैयारियों को लेकर दिल्ली 19वां राज्य था 24 कैसे जीतना है और बिल्कुल आदेश हुआ है कि हमें सातों सीटों पर मजबूत संगठन के साथ हर नेता को आज से अभी से निकलना है सात महीने सात सीटें हैं ये बात हुई कि जिसकी दिल्ली उसका देश होता है ये दिल्ली का इतिहास बताता है इसलिए कहा गया की बिल्कुल सातों पर तैयारी रखनी है Let me actually bring in my colleague Pallavi Ghosh on the broadcast for more on this. Uh, Pallavi, this is a big announcement as far as the Congress party is concerned ahead of the 2024 elections. And Congress, they're making it very, very clear that between the Congress and uh, the new alliance as far as uh, India is concerned, there is not going to be any seat sharing between Amadmi Party and Congress. Things over here. First of all, is that she's saying, let's get ready for all the seven seats. Yeah. This may not be the final word yet, mm -hmm. uh, because I think, and as we've been maintaining, the real problem in the India front coalition will begin when this whole talk on seat sharing and seat distribution begins, which means mm -hmm. in a Mumbai summit, this is also one of the topics which are going to be decided. What okay. has been decided till now is that as far as the strength of any political party is concerned, priority will be given to that political party as far as the seat distribution is concerned. Using this yardstick, because the AAP is already in power in Delhi, the AAP will naturally lay claim to all those seven seats. As of now, all the seven are actually with the BJP. So I think in terms of winnability, mm. AAP will clearly lay the claim that we have better chances than the Congress party, but will Congress accept it? Yeah. As it is, many Delhi Congress leaders like Ajay Makar and Sandeep Dikshin are unhappy yes. with the support which has been given by the Congress party to Delhi uh, ordinance bill is concerned. But Pallavi, when it is about this dialogue, this channel being opened between the Aam Aadmi Party and the Congress, is there any room for that sort of a dialogue where a sheet seat uh, sharing uh, formula can really be discussed between the two parties? I, I think when I just mentioned the Mumbai summit, that exactly mm. is going to be the platform on which mm. the seat sharing is going to become. Mumbai summit is important for two reasons. One, a common minimum program or at least the work will begin on that. But more importantly, they start discussing the seat, uh, sharing arrangements. With just seven months left to go for Lok Sabha elections, there's not too much of time. And this is where the problems could surface. Uh, okay. AAP versus Congress, TMC versus Congress, and specifically talking about Delhi, Congress wouldn't want to budge an inch. On the other hand, AAP hmm. equally would feel that we have a better chance than Congress to win these elections. All right, Pallavi, thank you so much for joining us on the broadcast with all the latest that we are picking up on this story. A big statement there by Congress leader Alka Lamba, where she, in fact, goes on to suggest that the possibility of seat sharing between the Aam Aadmi Party and the Congress Party ahead of 2024 elections might not really be the reality that these alliance partners are looking at. With that, we're slipping into a very, very short break, coming right back with all the top stories on CNN News 18.